it survived passing trends and changes in fashion to become a Reading institution. It, of course, is Hickey's Music Store, celebrating its 150th. And appropriately to mark the occasion, it has awarded scholarships to two music students. Well, Richard Jones went there and came back with the story. In an age when all town centres tend to look the same and have the same shops, a place like Hickey's does stand out, not just because of what it sells, but also because of how it sounds. Here, Try Before You Buy takes on a whole new meaning. The ethos of the shop is really for people to not only learn or play an instrument, but to, to enjoy it. So we do encourage people to play, um, to play instruments and, um, and, and try them out. Um, you don't know what you want to play until you've until you had a go, really. For a hundred years, Hickey's has been run by the Elphick family. In that time, much has changed. Trends in music have come and gone. But the shop not only survives, but thrives. Basically, we're a family business. Um, I suppose, to a certain extent, we're a bit bloody-minded and want to keep it going, really. Um, it's, um, you'll never make a fortune out of, out of um, selling musical instruments and, and music and so on. Um, but, um, I mean, we're fortunate in that we own the property from which we trade. Um, that is a big, a big bonus. Um, I think if we had to pay economical rents now, that would, we, would, we would struggle. To celebrate the anniversary, Hickey's has awarded scholarships to two students from Deanfield School. They're studying music and will receive tuition from the shop's experts for two years. Chris is... is has kind of been working and self-taught and has got a natural flair, but has been self-taught and now needs, I believe, uh, some some structure coming in. So for him, it's going to be really useful to take him through the course and, and further on. Savannah is a beginner and a very good singer, but that doesn't help her with the music reading. So we needed to find an instrument she'd be interested in learning. So she's keen to play the uh, guitar. And, uh, you know, so... For the next two years, she's going to be learning this instrument at least and using that as her core instrument for the course. They're just the latest in a long line of Reading musicians who've been inspired by Hickey's to pick up an instrument and play. Richard Jones, ITV News, Reading.